Mixed martial arts is back in the national spotlight thanks to the revival in popularity of the Ultimate Fighting Championships. And one local man is using that spotlight to educate and empower men and women. Senior digital content producer Donna Natosi and chief photographer Mark Barger have the story. I've been training for about eight years and uh, fighting professionally for about six. I was stationed on uh, Camp Lejeune a few years ago. It was active duty, we used to chill in the barracks. My roommates and I, we would just watch a show about the Ultimate Fighter. So we used to always talk about, oh man, when I, you know, when I get out, I could do that. After my contract was up, I found a local gym, started training. The rest is history. It looks like uh, Owens is letting loose. One of my training partners had an amateur fight fall through. He got injured, and my coach encouraged me to just, you know, step in his place. Oh my goodness, Dewan Owens right on top of his opponent. I won my first fight, and I, it's like at that moment, I felt like everything was right. This matchup is over, an impressive victory for this man, Dewan Owens. Initially, uh, the trip just started as something I was doing for my, myself. I met a fellow humanitarian online. Our ideologies aligned as far as what we wanted to do uh, for the community. So I wound up going to Uganda. Reading a lot of things about uh, gender-based violence and how prevalent it was. Wherever you have uh, poverty, uh, the higher the poverty, the higher the, the crime rate is. So I really wanted to focus on not only the uh, mixed martial arts and jiu-jitsu aspect, but the self-defense aspect. I didn't realize just how powerful it was until I saw the reactions from some of the, the students, especially the women, when they saw that the techniques work, that, hey, this can work against a competent, uh, resistant opponent. Next on the agenda, I'm going to uh, Dakar in Senegal. This is West Africa. It's going to be along the same lines. So I'll be doing a little more uh, mixed martial arts and uh, kickboxing instruction. So we'll also be um, connecting with some initiatives based around uh, self-defense and uh, gender-based violence prevention. Elevate MMA is holding a fundraising event to help Dewan continue his journey Sunday, February 26th. To get to details and become a part of the effort, just go to our website, twcnews.com.